Presenting This Week from Fantasyland, The Antioch Adventure, an introduction into the exciting world of college. You'll thrill to this courageous story of an Antioch boy and girl's search for identity and escape from reality. You'll enjoy every perilous moment as they struggle against the forces of the academic environment. Now, here is your host, Mark Stone. Hi. You're probably wondering why my head is turned away from the camera. That's because this is a low-budget student production, and we're doing a synchronous sound sequence, and we can't afford for you to see my face and my lips moving. Now you're probably wondering why I have my hand in front of my mouth. That's so that you can't tell that my lips are not moving in time with my voice. Oh, wait a minute. The synchronous sound equipment has just arrived. Good evening. As I was browsing through my library, I happened to come across what turned out to be the gateway to an effervescent excursion into the annals of our rich American folklore. I refer to this all but forgotten volume, which represents in such vivid detail the thrills and wonders of what we proudly recognize as the college climate. Thanks to the inspiration it has provided our studio staff, we now invite you to join with us as we accompany Mary Lou Merriweather and Durwood Braintree Jr. Two youngsters who suddenly find themselves in the throes of college life as they experience the Antioch adventure. So hold on, young America, for here they come. Don't mind me. I'm just here, shall we say, to help you along. Kind of a male version of Mary Poppins. Whenever you need me, I'll be here. you better be going. You can't keep them waiting, you know. Mm -hmm. 
They said they'd have someone to meet you, didn't they? Well, maybe they're on their way. Let's get the luggage. Oh, don't worry about me. I'll see you later, when you get to Antioch. Welcome to Antioch College, nestled in the rural arms of picturesque Yellow Springs, Ohio, in the heart of the Miami Valley. Kissed by sunshine, embraced by rolling carpets of green, Antioch snuggles peacefully alongside beautiful Glen Helen, 1,000-acre extension of the campus along cliffs and forested slopes in the Little Miami River watershed. This scenic terrain, first carved by glacial meltwaters, modified by ceaseless weathering and biotic succession, utilized by prehistoric Indians and then white men attracted to its famous springs, remains a rich resource for the study of natural and human history and provides varied recreation and outdoor experiences for Antiochians. After a short drive down scenic Route 68, you are soon confronted with an overwhelming panorama. The first picture of hustling, bustling downtown Yellow Springs. The city gets its name from the amber-colored freshwater spring located in the Glen. It also gets its amber-colored fresh water from the same spring located in the Glen. This then is Yellow Springs, playground of Antioch College. We'll be back to Mary Lou Merriweather after this word from the Miami Deposit Bank. Whether it's a savings or checking account, you'll find the Miami Deposit Bank is ready to serve you. Never hold up with convenient hours and a drive-in window. You'll find our staff pleasant and cooperative, ready to help you with all your banking needs. Come in and open an account with us soon. We're in Yellow Springs to serve you. The Miami Deposit Bank. As you remember, Mary Lou had arrived on campus and finds herself about to experience her first meal in the college cafeteria. Your first class? Remember what the college catalog said. Antioch classes are marked by a high degree of informality and relaxation. <laughs> Today, class, we have Bob Dylan, who is uh, considered to talk to us about some questions on poetry. But first, the Bob. Uh, you dropped out of college and never returned. Do you think you will ever start in again? Start again? <laughs> Where is that hall advisor who said he'd meet you? 
Well, maybe you should find a meeting yourself. Let's see, they said it would be in room 201. Maybe it was 102. That's it. Uh, Come on, baby. Pour it on this time, baby. More, baby. Uh, more, more. Much more. Uh, ah, now I remember. It was at the end of the hall. Before the sperm could join the egg and you could start growing to become a baby, your mother and your father first had to learn to know and love each other. Yes, your father needed to be sure that he had found the woman whom he would like to have become the mother of his children. Your mother needed to be sure that she had found the man who she would like to have become the father of her children. <laughs> but ever since they had grown up, each of them had been looking... For His name was Durwood Raintree, Jr. That is and beyond a, a doubt was the most magnificent creature she had ever set her eyes upon. He liked her, too. Doing this, but they were. We'll be back to share in the excitement of their first date. After this word from Irvon Johnson Drugstore. Irvon Johnson Drugstore has been serving Antioch students for years. It just makes good sense for you to do all your shopping for drug needs, toiletries, greeting cards, and last moment gifts at Irvon Johnson. Prescriptions filled while you wait. You can trust Irvon Johnson's. Yellow Springs mothers have for years. that dreamy. And to make the evening super special, he's even treating you to a jazz burger in Antioch's famous after-hours hangout, the Cozy Sea Shop. Tur riff
found themselves faced with their first problem. He loved dancing and she couldn't. What to do? We'll return with the answer right after this brief message from Luttrell's Super Value. No matter what the season, no matter what the reason, you'll love the selection of fresh foods at Luttrell's Super Value. For a special supper menu or just snacks, Luttrell's caters to your particular fancy. All varieties of fruits, chips, dips, and sodas are at Luttrell's. Great for one-stop party shopping. You'll find our prices lowest and quality the best at Luttrell's. Mary Lou, I know you're depressed, but you just can't run away from it got to face the problem. Durwood hasn't called you and he's not gonna until you learn to dance. Now you want Durwood to call you, don't you? All right, come with me. Now sit down, see that record? Now put it on and think. good things must come to an end. This happy and lasting relationship is brought to a stop as Mary Lou and Durwood get ready to go on their first co-op job. She 
worked as an assistant teacher at the Priscilla Pringle Private School for Precocious Prodigies. His choices were for three New York office jobs. He ended up in North Dakota as a hospital attendant, a job he neither wanted nor could stomach. Porter started off beautifully. She watched his bio experiments. Wet sponge. Wet sponge. Wet sponge. Wet sponge. Snap. 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 How's blood pressure? Good. Another retractor. Another retractor. Another retractor. Another retractor. Glass of beer. Glass of Glass of beer. Glass of beer. Scissors. 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 Scalpel. 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 Temperature. Temperature. Normal and rising. Suture. 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 Countdown minus ten. Nine. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Beautiful delivery, Derwood. Congratulations, boys. Fine job. That's nice work. That's beautiful. Yes, That's beautiful. Beautiful. Sheer genius, Derwood. Sheer genius. Thank you. Lovely work. Just lovely. Thank you very much. Unbelievable. It was just marvelous. Thank you very, really very tough, much. Really tough, Derwood. Really tough. Fine job of surgery, my boy. Oh, thank you. Uh, just, just too much. That was just too much. Thank you. Out of sight. Fantastic, Derwood. Fantastic. Thank you. Thank you. He attended her art class. We'll continue, but first, D&G has this word of interest for you all. Everyone loves to listen to the radio. But when that radio don't sound like it oughta, everyone's glad about D&G. 
because they know all about radios, selling them and fixing them. TVs and record players, too. Need a tube check free or a whole set rewired? See the folks at D&G. Tell them the old ranger sent you. But it is spring, and with spring comes warm weather, and thoughts turn away from studies to other outdoor pursuits. Also with spring come problems, and with our couple, it was no different. It is 5.30 in the morning. It is very quiet, and the campus is asleep. An occasional industrious student may be putting the final touches on a last-minute paper. An involved card party is at last disbanding and a favorite campus pet enjoys a rare moment of peace. Antioch is still. Except for the Bingle Bangers. They are just finishing up for the night. A soul in search of adventure may find himself on many a back road. And so, 
Our boy seeks an impersonal relationship with one of the famed girls from Bingo.
my goodness. She, she, she fell in. She fell in. She, she almost drowned. She may be dead. Dead? Oh, no, I'm sure she's not dead. Here, why don't you take this form, just fill it out, and here are two little aspirin. Have her take these and call the clinic on Friday to make an appointment for Monday with Dr. Greenbine. Now get her dried off and run along and don't bother me anymore. Back in a moment, but first this word from Joe Hollies. Have your dry cleaning and laundry done by experts. Let us take care of your clothes. Fast quality service. Remember. If you want your clothes clean, Joe Hollies will play. If you want your Everybody knows it, smile on the face. In Yellow Springs, have your clothes clean where they're assured the finest care. Joe Holly's Cleaners. Mary Lou recovered. Durwood, however, didn't. He was so embarrassed by the whole episode that he locked himself in his room and wouldn't talk to anyone. have been accused of window breaking, a violation of Handbook Rule 32, page 91, section 11. You must go before a pencil, you imbecile, to receive the ultimate judgment. The boy was sentenced by Rapenzel to be tied to a tree on Red Square and picketed. But wait, who will save our young lad from this terrible fate? A fiery horse with the speed of light, a cloud of dust, and a hearty high silver! The Lone Ranger! Antioch, uh, bookstore, a uh, take four. The bookstore presents an Antioch adventure. This has been an Antioch adventure. Happening! Brought to you by the Antioch College Bookstore. What's with you, Mary Lou? You say tonight is Div Dance, and you've been sitting here for three days, and, and you almost died of hunger, and the phone rang 3,572 times, and, and not once was it for you? Is that what's bugging you, Mary Lou? Say, all you friends out there in the theater audience, if all of you who want Durwood to call Mary Lou will clap your hands together very loud and wish very hard, I know that Mary Lou's dream will come true. All right, are you ready now? <laughs> clap really loud, boys and girls.
passed quickly, and it was almost graduation. The boy and girl were finishing up senior seminars before the big day. Now, I looked at you tonight and you weren't there. Bonnie snapped. And, and I'm gonna howl it out. And I'm not gonna give a damn what I do and I'm gonna make the biggest goddamn explosion you've ever heard. You try and I'll beat you at your own game. Is that a threat, George, huh? That's a threat, Martha. You're gonna get it, baby. Be careful, Martha. I'll rip you to pieces. You are not mad enough. You haven't the guts. It was a beautiful Ohio day when Mary Lou Merriweather and Durwood Raintree Jr. graduated from college. Degrees in hand and hearts aglow, they headed into the future toward that great co-op job in the sky. Antioch Adventure is a Mark Stone production, produced in association with the Antioch College Community Government. Photographed by Richard Bash. Mr. Bash was assisted by Alicia Weber, Jim Mayer, Louis Jaffe, and David Hansen. Technical advisor to Mr. Bash, Stephen Dunbar, with costumes by Janet Horton, wardrobe from the fig leaf. Properties by Linda Sim and Judy Apple. Makeup by Megan Rosenfeld. Choreography by Judith Bettelheim. Continuity executed by Karen Stone. Sound manager, John Zimmerman. Studio sound, Jay Tuck. Location sound, Vic Pollock and Brian Woodruff. Div dance was staged by Patty Emder. Titles by Leslie Waltzer and Richard Turner. The Antioch Adventure was written by Mark Stone and Asad Kalata and starred Jessica Lipnack and John Draper with James Dixon, Paula John, Miriam Dickinson, Dan Hotelli, Wally Sykes, Keith McGarry, Don Myatt, Dick Meisler, Walter Anderson, F. Scott Toby, Skip Faust, Leon Holster, and many more. Production manager, Sherry Burfine. Edited by John Zimmerman. Assisted by Christopher Lay. Sound editor, Vic Pollock. Copyright, 1967, a Mark Stone production.